hey guys welcome to another video and this video I will show you the easiest way to install Windows on any Mac one of the key benefits of running a Mac is that you can enjoy having Mac OS and Windows on the same computer this entire process is very simple and very easy to do so follow the steps and you will have Windows on your Mac in half an hour Installing Windows on Mac need minimum 50 GB of space. So at first let's check the disk space. It has 50 GB so there shouldn't be any problem. Then we need to download Windows 10 ISO file and this will allow you to install Windows 10 on your Mac using Bootcamp Assistant. So here first select the Windows 10 version then click confirm and then select the language then click the 64 bit download and the Windows 10 download will begin. For this video, I already downloaded the ISO file. So now we need to configure Bootcam Assistant. So go to your finder, then go to application, and there you should see the Bootcam Assistant. So open Bootcamp and then click continue. And then click browse and choose your ISO file. From here, you can select how much partition you need. For Windows and how much for Mac. I'm gonna choose 32 GB and then click install. And then choose continue on battery power. This entire process depends on your internet speed. I have sped this a little bit so you don't have to wait for it to complete. Now just put your password here and then click OK. Then it's going to reboot your Mac and you're gonna boot into Windows Setup. I have sped this up a little bit throughout this entire Windows 10 installation. So here is the Windows logo and then you're gonna see this page right here. Here I recommend choosing customize that way you can turn off all the little personalization features and then later you can turn them on if you want to. Next just type username for it but it's not recommended to give a password so I'm gonna leave this blank and it is continuing to load. This does take a while obviously speed it up a little bit. And here is your Windows 10 installed on MacBook Pro. Now you see the bootcam installer, this is gonna install the necessary drivers to work with your Mac. So now bootcamp is installed, just click finish and it's gonna reboot. And now that all the drivers are installed, we can use our Wi-Fi connection. So connect it to the Wi-Fi. So now we are connected to the Wi-Fi. We can go to start menu and run apple software update that it needs to download from the internet so it's checking for update and here it is the wi-fi update so select it and click install then click yes and there you go so after the update installed you are almost finished and if your windows is not activated then activate it so how to reboot into mac os you just click the system tray then click where it says boot camp and click restart in Mac OS. So that will reboot you directly to your Mac OS. So to go back to the Windows, just go to the System Preferences and then click on Startup Disk and then authenticate with the password and unlock. Now select Windows instead of Macintosh HD and then click Restart and that will automatically boot you into Windows. And another option, the one that I like, is to reboot your computer while holding the option key on your keyboard. By doing this, you get to select which system you want to boot into. Just like this. So that's it guys. If you followed these steps, you will have no problem installing Windows on your Mac. Feel free to comment down below if you are having any questions. Also, do not forget to like this video and subscribe. I'm Amar signing off and hope to see you in my next video.